thinking too much about the moment, obviously it's in the back of your mind, but uh, you know, we were both getting pretty tired, I think, and, and uh, at that point you're really just playing on muscle memory, and uh, so I was just, just able to, to really play you know, my best tennis at the end there. Yes, please. More questions? Yeah. No? Are you going to play double play? Uh, yeah, we'll see. I think so. Uh, I, mean, I haven't really talked to, to the captain about it, but uh, so far it's, it's on the schedule. How do you feel? I mean, I'm, I'm tired, of course. I mean, I just played a five-hour high setter, but, but uh, hopefully I'll be able to sort of recover quickly and, and gather my strength from the doubles. Uh, it seemed during the match, uh, at least in some few portions of it, you weren't very happy or you were agitated, you threw some balls around, were you not happy with your tennis or was it something else? No, well, no, 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 my tennis, I thought I was playing well, but I, I just missed some opportunities, you know, in, in the, obviously the second set I had two set points in the tie break, and then the fourth set I was up a break, 4-2, uh, so just, you know, missing those opportunities and kind of tensing up a little bit, letting, letting Goody get back to the match, I was just a bit irritated with myself, and, uh, but, I, but I never gave up. Fighting to the end. So, one question. Were you surprised by the tennis of Dubisela today? Because yesterday at the press conference, you told that you're not the favorite of this game. But during the match, it seemed like you were controlling all the, the whole situation. Mm. No, I no. I mean, obviously, I, I I'm confident in my game. I didn't consider myself the favorite. Obviously, he's top 100. He's, he's been in the top 30. A couple years ago, he's a great player, and I'm playing here in Israel in front of his, his fans and his crowd. So, uh, by no means did I consider myself the favorite, but did I believe that I could win? For sure. I mean, I, I've had good wins uh, lately, so I, I believe in myself. And uh, when I'm playing well, I, I think I can give a lot of trouble to these guys. But during the game, were you surprised? During the game, no. Uh, like, the surprise that I was winning or playing close? Or no, no. I mean, like I said, going into the match, it's. Uh, I mean, I, I felt like I had a chance to win, so, so obviously when I was winning, I wasn't uh, surprised because I've beaten good players the last two months, so I, I knew I could do it here, so it didn't really surprise me when I was up. But... Yes, please. Uh, 
but obviously if I was losing, it wouldn't surprise me either. So I, I was just, you know, there and I knew, you know, anybody could win. So. Okay. Uh, when you beat uh, Chela at the Rogers Cup, mm -hmm. uh, did the Canadian uh, supporters chill like this? Oh yeah. Well, I mean, this this was this was a great atmosphere as well. But in in Canada, I had an incredible uh, crowd support. It was very similar to this, uh, if not the same. It was it was really that third set was uh, that crowd was was incredible. They really helped me through that match. And so I played in front of atmospheres like this, but just for me and not against me. Right here. <laughs> Uh, most of the year you played futures and challengers, and then you went to be, becoming a better player. Mm -hmm. What did you change? Was it a mental thing or a technical thing? Well, uh, yeah, but I I, uh, I started working with a with a new coach. But I mean, uh, I, I always had I was always playing well. I thought I always had a good level, but it was uh, more like to gain confidence. And I started working really really hard this year, um, working with. Uh, Fred Niemeyer, who's, uh, who's an NX player, and, and uh, just working really hard and, and getting some wins and gaining confidence and uh, getting my fitness level up there. I wasn't uh, the fittest player in the past. I think all those elements kind of combined have made me a better player. And uh, but, but I think the, the key thing right now is, is just confidence because, uh, you know, maybe in the past I, I haven't played against players like this and I didn't really know where my game was at, but, but now, uh, now I've beaten some really good players so I know I can play with these guys. Questions? Okay, thank you very much.